Welcome to Tech Brothers with Damir. In this video, we are going to answer this question. Can you create a parameter reports by using report wizard? The answer is yes, but I will not stop myself just saying yes. That's not enough. I will go ahead and explain more details. So first of all, I'm going to go and create a report by wizard and show you it can create a report with single value, multi value parameters. So click on the reports tab, add new report. So the wizard is starting right here, hit next, select the shared data source and now we can write our query. So I'm going to write query, select asterisk from db or total sale table where I have a region column that I would like to create as a single value parameter and then I'm going to use country as multi value parameter. So you see that with the region I have equal sign and with the country I have in clause that make them this equal make them single value and in clause make it multi value parameter hit next and select tabular or matrix tabular is fine with me I'm going to select few of the fields here so let me select few country and region hit next next and provide the name we are all good here and let's go ahead and preview our report you see region and country parameters are created now I can provide the value Asia and then country Pakistan and if you know that we have Pakistan and India but we do not see any data for both countries if I will just provide Pakistan it's gonna just work just fine so you see that I have the data for Pakistan and same thing for India so Report wizard let you create uh, the report with the parameters, but there are few things you have to come back uh, in the design and play with the parameters properties. Uh, as uh, in the report wizard, we didn't get those properties. Uh, let's say in the countries, it never asks us, uh, hey, is this a single value or multi value parameter? And uh, we have to fix that. Um, we will be coming back here in the country parameters and allow multiple values has to be checked. So we check this one. Now, if I will go ahead and preview report, I can. Uh, type single value and then here in the country now I can go ahead and provide other countries Pakistan and India for Asia and I will see all the records so you see that it can create let you create a very simple reports with the parameter there is no problem but you will be coming back to fix different properties of the parameter think about a cascading parameter report so here let's say we created this single value parameter and the country with multi value if we would like to make them them a cascading parameter report the wizard don't have any option and it never ask it is cascading or it is a, a depending on one parameter is depending on other it don't ask that questions so after creating very simple report you have to come back and fix those things by yourself I will say it is a good idea to start with the report wizard quickly and then you can come back and make those changes now let's go ahead and in this report we use the query I'm gonna use the store procedure and show you the same thing so go to the add new report wizard will start and then we are gonna select the shared data source that's fine and here we have to provide the store procedure so I have written a store procedure that accepts a region as a parameter and you see that if I run this one this is going to return us some records so I'm going to take this execute procedure statement and go back to the SS DT SQL Server data tools paste it here and then I have to provide the parameter so at the rate region that's a that's it so you will be using store procedure and then have to provide the parameter and hit next tell what type of report you would like to create tabular is fine with me I'm gonna select a few of the columns and put in detail country and region now I hit next next and finish report third or three is created now I preview my report and here is my region parameter I can provide Asia I can provide Europe so whatever parameter you have created you have the values for that provide that and that's how you will see the report again if it is multi value parameter some it's not gonna go ahead and fix all those things for you so you have to go to parameter properties and play with it provide the available values provide the default values and uh, that's the one thing so report 
wizard will let you create but you have to come back and make some modifications thanks very much and explain all details in the interview they will be really helpful good luck with your interview i will see you guys in next video bye